looking for that next breakout tight end, the guy you can grab later in your draft and look like a genius come year end, I've got the guy for you. His name's David Njoku, and I think he's gonna absolutely explode in 2019. Here's why. Top five running back. You're watching the Fantasy Football Show. David Njoku has all the measurables. He's 6'4", he's 264 pounds. The Browns went after this guy in the draft. And while he didn't explode to the degree many thought he could have in 2018, he's fifth most in receptions in league history for tight ends under the age of 23. And those stats indicate he's not off to a slow start. In fact, he's off to a very fast start. This offense is going to score a lot of points they're going to be right up there with kansas city in terms of being one of the most aggressive offenses in the nfl and while no one's saying Najoku is going to get the kind of yardage that a kelsey might get tight ends in that range of five to ten don't get that kind of yardage anyway so you need to look at Najoku in that tight end six to ten range a guy that might get you 900 yards but he can also potentially deliver double digit touchdowns Baker Mayfield and that Cleveland Browns passing attack will crank out the passing TDs. Baker Mayfield trusts him. Look, with a tight end that hasn't done much yet, keeping in mind that we do have a pretty significant impressive stat, fifth most receptions in league history for tight ends under the age of 23. That's impressive. But I know many are going to say, well, you have no evidence that he's going to really thrive and become the tight end you're predicting. I get it. Sometimes all we have is the eye test. Sometimes we don't have a lot to go on. In 2018, he had 639 yards off 56 receptions and four TDs. I see no reason he can't pull in 70 balls for 900 yards and 10 TDs in 2019. If you want to wait on a tight end and take a guy that potentially could be, in hindsight, worth the kind of draft slot where you're taking the very next guy after the big three, like O.J. Howard, then Njoku's your guy. Roll the dice on Njoku, who's going to live inside the red zone. At 6'4", 264, Baker Mayfield is going to lean on him heavily. Don't miss out on owning this guy at a uh, 8.4 ADP. The risk is very low. The upside is potentially league winning. <laughs> My name's Smitty, WhySleeperU.com. For one, I've been dropping and landing some of the biggest bull predictions in the industry for over 15 plus years. I started doing bull predictions and really kicking off my fantasy football career on the radio show. Those bull predictions started to manifest into what is now our biggest and most sought after product, the Bull Predictions Board, which has landed Alvin Kamara. Patrick Mahomes was number one on the bull predictions last year, and James Conner was number two. All the way back to Arian Foster. Arian Foster, he's a guy we've been recommending people reach for in the fourth and fifth round in most drafts. I see nothing but big things for this guy and he's my monster breakout uh, prediction for 2010. Why pay for a draft kit that's three or four pages or a PDF or going to be outdated when you can have a fully functional arsenal, a sensory overload experience wow. at sleeperu.com. That's right. Sleeper. You. Learn about it. Woo! But the site is so much more than just bold predictions. It's year-round rankings, projections, trade calculators, draft simulators, and probably the most exciting feature that we've ever had is the one-on-one -on -one advice where I email with you, you ask me questions via email all year, and I get back to you within 24 hours, sometimes hours or even minutes, depending on when you email me. I will give you Tom Brady for your Julio Jones. year-round rankings, player trade calculators. I invented the instant trade calculator in 2004 in the fantasy football space, and I've been innovating ever since. I have arguably the first mock draft simulator ever created in fantasy football. Woo! That's included in the product, all the rankings, the year-round content, and the one-on-one -on -one advice. So if you want this year's Alvin Kamara or this year's James Conner, I want to give you that advantage to crush your competition ahead of the curve thinking advice that goes against the grain. We are bold. We are extreme. We are a sleeper you, and I want you to be a part of it. He could miss a couple games and still earn his second drafted second round value 